Hi, viewers. Welcome back to um, the, tea, the Girl With No Name Tea Room or something. What is this called? Um, it doesn't even say. I guess it doesn't matter. Point is a uh, side quest. That's how I'm going to start off this part because guess what? Uh, I, totally, I totally brought this up last time. And uh, you know what? What we need to do right now because I got five. We need to totally trade in these for that. Yeah. I need it. What's the stuff about invoking champions? With invocation, you can call upon the mediums you've met for help. And then they will fight alongside you in the field of battle. Dude, what? Really? Really. The catch is, you can only invoke their power for a very limited time. Basically, they pop right in and push right back out. Pop. Push. Got it. Hmm. All the same, the fact that we can invoke them at all... It sounds pretty useful. Yeah, it'll make collecting mirages way easier. All right, but there are restrictions. First, not all mediums are champions. They must awaken to their true potential before you can invoke them. Furthermore, some champions awaken in stages, and each to their own abilities. You'll need armor gems to awaken them, and you'll want to put some thought into who you're going to invoke. And at what time, for that matter? Uh, yeah. And invoking isn't free. You have to bend all kinds of divine rules to pull it off, which means more compensation. And I guess we can't pay in Arma gems? Not the gems. Use those here to awaken champions. To invoke, you'll have to store up a different kind of tender. Why don't you think of it as a kind of gauge? When you have enough champion points, you can invoke them. Oh. That's super easy to understand. So, how do we go about storing champion points then? Wear down your souls. Huh? To put it simply, the gauge fills when you're hurt and when you defeat mirages. Um, right. Okay. So basically, all we have to do is keep fighting. Correct. Mm. Oh, I won't overthink it. Oh. One thing, many champions can be found across Grimoire, but you will only be able to call upon three of them at any given time. Think carefully about the situation, and choose the champion suited to the task at hand. But, why? It takes a lot of connecting the dots to make sure they can reach you. Unfortunately, three is the most that I can handle, but if you're willing to offer up your souls as additional portals, then I could arrange something. I... I'm pretty sure there's no way that can be good, so we'll pass. Oh, come on, Rain. What's the worst that could happen? You die? <laughs> Anyways, no. Uh, so, mediums and champions, uh, guess what? They're like your summons, and they're pretty cool. I'll be showing them all off, or at least I'll try to. Uh, but we got the Warrior of Light. So that's pretty cool. Uh, and he's our champion medal, and so I gotta equip him. And we got our champion gauge, as they said. The more damage we take, the more mirages we defeat, it fills up. That, that's cool. Um, I guess it's all irrelevant. Point is, go to your champion medal, and then you're like, Oh man, who do I want? Well, let me tell you. Oh! Damn, son, I got like, I got Sephiroth and Sora. Um, I should explain. So, when you like, get the, uh... When you get, like, the pre-order bonus pack or whatever, which includes several mirages, and, of course, the Sephiroth medal, you, you get that. Uh, Sora is, like, DLC that you can get right now for free as an ad bonus. So, you know what? I guess all three of my uh, slots will be filled with uh, yours truly. Also, it tells you the gauge cost. So, basically, these two... Are only gonna cost one star. Well, Sora, he's gonna cost a whopping two stars. Um, I'm not gonna overthink it too much. Basically, I I can summon them. It's really all there is Hello. to be said about that, and that's now, pretty cool. Uh, which champion would you? Oh man. Okay. Uh, I can trade in, but I have nothing to trade in. So intervene. That was the last thing I could do. And uh, oh man. Look at that. Five stars compared to one star. The girl forgot her name. Um, 
Okay, look. Uh, you got the summary. It talks about the Warrior of Light patrolling the streets of Cornelia. Yeah, let's do that. Um, let's do it. You gotta be good, right? I never believed it to be more than a legend. A bedtime story someone concocted to fill the dreams of children. But the warriors of light are real. One lives in me. Shocking, and yet, this part of me has stirred before. <laughs> I must be more tired than I thought. Far too much excitement all at once. Hmm? You won't find her. After all, she likes spending time with her subjects. You were mistaken to search here. Huh? How did we get ourselves back into battle? From this room, you can take control of your friends' destinies and redirect the course of their lives by fighting their most crucial battles. So it's like, we're helping them in secret? You can think of it like that. Hey, get ready. You know, I, I just had like this weird epiphany that was like, I, I could technically tame these goblins if they were imprisonable, right? Uh, can, can we all agree that technically this, this is a thing I could do because it's like the first mirage I, I've ran into in the uh, tea room place. Uh, I don't know what I'm saying other than uh, that. So uh, I, I guess technically if I could imprison them, that, that would be a thing I could do, right? Oh, that guy hurts. Oh no, please. Please don't kill my Mandicore guy. I, I worked hard to get him. Let's see, uh... Well... You know, I think, I think Lon can technically live through this. I gotta figure out how I'm gonna go about this. Um, what can I do? What can I do? What can I do? Okay, first off... I'm gonna use an item, right? I'm gonna use... I'm gonna use the potion on Lon, because uh, not having any of those guys die would probably be very beneficial. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna take out uh, you, because I feel like if I take out one of them, it's probably gonna be beneficial for all of us, at least. So I will sacrifice you, and then uh, Lon. My my main thing is keeping you. Healed up, cause uh, let's, let's face it, I got enough potions, and I don't, I don't want like Mandagora to die. Oh no, no, <laughs> my my heart is very heavy right now. This is almost the equivalent of playing uh, Lisa, the painful RPG. I'm having minor heart palpitations. <laughs> um. I got, I got, I got, I got to try. Okay, stuttering. I'm just really nervous, cause I'm, I'm. Oh no. I may have done a stupid. Um, I may have not been ready for this. Period. May have helped if I had something else to go on. All right. How, how to go about this? Okay. Uh. This might be the worst thing I've ever done, but I, I gotta try. Okay, we killed one. That's gonna be very beneficial for all of us. Um, next thing I gotta do is obviously I gotta I gotta heal these. Actually, uh, you know what? First off, I'm gonna do the wobble stopper because that get, having them gain stability and not having to unstack them might be beneficial for us. I'm just trying to calculate this all in my head. Um, they're my big stack. Having them live would absolutely make me happier. Uh, also something I want to do is make sure that they, they got the potion um, so that they can, they can live. Uh, something else I want to do, I want to take down this guy. Critical or what have you might be beneficial. Uh, 
Also, having them live might also be beneficial. Let's see. What? I gotta think about this very carefully, because this, this can be a very dangerous situation. Alright, let's see. Unstack. And then restack. I think we can be okay. I think we can take this guy down. Um... I think we have the cure ability. I wasn't ready for any of this. I feel, I feel, I feel a heavy, heavy pain in my heart right now. <laughs> Cause Tama is the only thing that I'm, I'm oh God. Oh God. <laughs> there, there's this part that's just like, you done fucked up, Gildum. <laughs> very, very badly. I should have came in with like a full a full stack, you know what I'm talking about? Like everything. Everything at once. Okay, let's see. Uh I don't have anything really, do I? I don't have any abilities. Um I don't have any I oh wait, wait, wait a second. Totally have items. Um Flash bombs. Uh, putting it on this guy Oh god. If it worked, that would have been dreamy. Because I wouldn't have to worry so much. Well, I'm just going to attack this guy. Attack that guy, and then I'm going to use the items. I might be okay. I killed one goblin. I might... Oh. That double thrust just does not make me feel comfortable at all. Um... They just don't do that much damage. All right. Uh, item potion. Do it. These interventions are a lot more uh, difficult than I thought they'd be. Oh, he missed. Okay. All right. We're good. We're good. Why well, ever decide to do a Nuzlocke challenge? This is the worst idea I may have had. Oh, they're going after Rain. Okay. Well, fortunately, she doesn't have to deal with uh, nearly as much problems. Let's see. Unstacked. I think. I think they can get through this much easier. Alright, uh, you know, I think, I think we got this. All I gotta do is just do that. Oh man. The goblin... Wow, that does a lot more damage. The goblin is, uh, completely imprisonable. Um, I'm just gonna have you defend. And then I'm gonna have you use the Libra. Cause I can totally imprison this guy. I think we're gonna be okay. Let's see. Uh, reduce the Mirage's HP. Okay, I can do that. Simple. Attack it. In that case, what I'm gonna do now? Now everything's looking up. Now everything's all right. I thought I thought I was doomed. It turns out that maybe I can actually get a Mirage, and you know what? It'll it'll be good. It'll be good for everyone. Um, you know what? Do it. What's the worst that could happen? Let's do it! In prison, baby! In prison! Oh! We got it! Goblin! Yes! This was the weirdest side quest I've ever done. Weirdest as in it took me longer than really necessary. And, uh... I, I think there was a lot of BS associated with it. But you know what? We got a new Mirage! We got a new Mirage, and you know, he's a pretty cool and nasty set of noshers, and, uh, but does not bite, whatever. I don't even care. Name him. Name him. Oh, man. Um, I gotta think of something. Uh, at the same time, you guys, 
Uh, I, I don't know. Um, I, I'm gonna end the part here, yeah. So I will see you guys later. Next time, you'll see why I named this guy, and it'll be uh, interesting. But I can totally use this on my team, and then Lon will actually be all right to go. Because this guy is a medium, and I can totally use a medium. Alright, see you next time.